Right now here at six, hundreds of CMS students visiting their teachers in schools before classes start next week. There's an open house tonight for parents and students. They can get the schedules. They can walk the hallway, sign up for clubs. The Lee C Charlotte Shamaria Morrison joining us live from this event going on at Harding University High School. You told us last hour, Shay, a lot of excitement. Hopefully that's continuing here into this hour. Yeah, it is, but it's a little bit more in the gym area where they, you know, can sign up for those clubs and things. Um, but that wasn't how it was at first. There was a little bit of confusion in the beginning. Some parents had some frustrations, but they said you have to practice grace sometimes. And that's how the new principal is hoping they do the entire year because he has big plans and also big expectations. From freshmen to seniors at Harding University High School, you can feel the excitement nervousness about the start of the new year. 10th grade and I'm really just expecting to make more friends, make more friends with teachers and stuff. This 10th grader will also have the chance to meet Harding's new principal, who has a lot of expectations for the new year. I feel a sense of um, a sense of urgency, right? There are kids lives that are at stake every day when they come on our campus. Right? The educational environment is extremely important for me. Hey, Ms. Price, you good? Principal Glenn Starn says safety, school test scores, workplace climate, it's all a balancing act. We're not going to wake up tomorrow and miraculously we are where we used to be. But we do want to be sure that we have a plan and a process to get there. Parents are looking to hold him accountable, especially for keeping students safe. After last year, guns were brought on campus and there were multiple fights. And they need to bring more um, people in to talk to them and teach them and get them other options to do other than that. Starnes wants to reach students where they are. Let's just talk straight from the heart. Let's hear about what matters to you, what's important to you, what do you think um, we should do and focus on going into the upcoming year. He has students willing to listen. Listen to what the students want for the school and you know try his best to like be more democratic I guess listening to what we will want. Time will tell if plans Starnes has will come to fruition. And as you can see behind me, this is an open campus. That's always a security concern. So those new body scanners that are in schools are actually in the main office. Students have to walk through them. There are security cameras here at Harding University High School, and there's also student resource officers. So those are just all the tools they're using in the toolbox to make sure that campus is a safe place for kids to come. Live at Harding University High School, Shamaria Morrison, WCNC Charlotte. Shay, thanks so much.